The Alberta Carbon Trunk Line, or ACTL project, will be the backbone for large-scale CO2 capture and transmission in the province of Alberta and is key to developing CO2-enhanced oil recovery in Alberta. For the first phase of the ACTL project, carbon dioxide is captured from Northwest Redwater Partnership Sturgeon Refinery and Agrium's Redwater Fertilizer Plant, where it is compressed to a near-liquid state and transported via pipeline to an existing oil field near Clive for enhanced oil recovery and carbon capture, utilization and storage. The capture and pipeline system and the Clive EOR are owned and operated by Enhance Energy, an Alberta-based oil company with extensive experience in building and operating CO2 EOR systems. The first phase will capture 5,000 tons a day of pure CO2, with an ultimate potential capacity of 40,000 tons a day. Extensive geological analysis has identified the Clive Field as one of the premier geologic traps in North America for enhanced oil recovery with permanent CO2 storage due to its unique shape and secure geology. Millions of years ago, oil began migrating to the Nisku and Leduc reservoirs, where the tiny pore spaces within the dome-like structure of the carbonate formation have retained the oil in place. The oil and gases have been contained underground by a thick impermeable layer of shale or cap rock, hundreds of feet thick, that forms a barrier naturally preventing fluids and gases from rising to the surface. Enhanced oil recovery with permanent CO2 sequestration or storage is a process where CO2 is injected into deep reservoirs to improve oil production and is a technique already used in more than 100 oil field operations in the United States and Canada. CO2 will be transported from the Alberta Industrial Heartland region to the Clive field where enhanced oil recovery with permanent CO2 storage will be used to extend the life of the Clive oil field for more than 25 years. The CO2 is injected in a liquid-like state almost two kilometers underground, the equivalent of 10 Calgary towers stacked one on top of the other. The CO2 travels down the wellbore to a precise and predetermined location within the rock formation that provides the greatest enhanced oil recovery and permanent CO2 storage benefit. As the CO2 mixes with the oil in the formation, the oil swells and it also reduces its viscosity, allowing the oil to flow more easily through the interconnected pore spaces towards the production well, which can result in 10 to 30% more oil production. This oil would not be able to be produced without a solvent agent such as CO2. During this process, the CO2 becomes trapped in the rock and is permanently stored in the pore spaces in the same way oil was trapped in the formation millions of years ago, with the cap rock serving as a physical barrier for the containment of the CO2. Other trapping mechanisms include the dissolution of CO2 in formation fluids and mineralization of the CO2 within the rock pore spaces. CO2 enhanced oil recovery can revitalize existing depleted fields bringing production levels close to original levels and extending the operating life for more than 25 years. As fluids and gases are produced from the well, they flow through a series of vessels that separate them at Enhance's separation facility. The oil is separated and stored in tanks prior to being delivered to market. A portion of the injected CO2 will be produced with the oil. This CO2 remains contained within the process system at all times. It is separated from the oil and is immediately combined with the CO2 arriving from Alberta's industrial heartland for reinjection into the formation. This is known as a closed loop process and ensures the injected CO2 is ultimately retained within the reservoir. Several methods will be employed to continuously monitor measure and verify the containment of the CO2 in the formation. Sophisticated detection techniques and equipment are used in the reservoir and on the surface to ensure the accurate and safe storage of the CO2, the protection of the underground sources of drinking water, and the public.
Successful carbon capture and enhanced oil recovery with permanent CO2 storage in a project of this magnitude requires extensive skills, resources, and experience. Enhance Energy has the requirements to successfully implement the ACTL project. Enhance Energy is excited to lead the development of EOR and CCS in the province of Alberta and to help establish Alberta as a leading environment steward.